YouTube channel of Lalbagh Girls Inter College. Dear students, in my last video, I have explained you the differences between growth and development. As I told you that growth and development plays an important role in everyone's life. So we must understand different stages of development. Today, I will explain you the different stages of child's development. You know what? Various changes from conceptions to death take place in the physical and psychological capacities of the child. There are certain periods in the process of development where certain characteristics, features of behavior stands out more prominently than other periods of life. They are termed as a stage. You know, student, the behavior of an infant is different from that of adolescents. So, it is desirable that for proper understanding of individuals, we may divide their life into various stages. These stages are infancy. This stage is running up to 5 to 6 years since birth. Childhood. Time period of childhood is 6 years to 12 years. Adolescence. This stage continues in between 12 to 18 years. Next is adulthood. This stage starts after the completion of 18 years of age. Means it starts after adolescence period. Yes. Now let's understand the infancy stage. Infancy stage. This is 0 to 5 to 6 years is infancy stage. This stage from birth to the end of 5 to 6 years of age is called infancy. The basic foundation of physical, mental and personality development are laid in this stage. It is also called early childhood stage. It is a time of tremendous growth across all area of development. You can also define it is as the first year of life after birth. Crow and Crow defines infancy that infancy on the average from birth to 5 or 6 years of age during which the sensory channels begins to develop. This is the age when child learns moving, walking and speaking. Now understand the characteristics of infancy stage. Rapid physical growth. It is a period of rapid growth and size and weight. You know what students? The average length of a newborn baby is 19 inches. But it varies from 17 to 21 inches. And the average weight of a newborn baby is 7 inches. Pounds. By the time the child is about 2 years of age, his weight becomes about 25 pounds. The bones and muscles of the child begins to develop. Growth during infancy is even faster than growth during puberty. Second, rapid mental growth. In this stage, brain grows rapidly. The glands begin to function properly. And at this stage, the grasping power of infant becomes stronger. As a consequence, what happens? His emotions, memory, imaginations and concentrations etc. develop. Rapid learning process. The child learns many things during this period. Next is development of social feeling. It is a stage when a child learns social feeling. A child learns about the relations and react accordingly. Fifth one is language development. Very rapid language development occurs in this stage. When a child born, he or she knows only weeping. And they show their emotions, their needs only through the weeping. But you will see after few months, he learns a few broken words. And by the time, the child learns some useful words. Next is imagination. At this stage, the behavior of the infant depends upon imagination. He keeps himself busy in such activities in which he can wander in imagination. They like to listen 
or watch the stories of fairy tales very much. There are many more characteristics of impulsive stages as sense of self-appreciation, attitude of repetition, absence of moral development, dependency, curiosity, imitation and so on. At this stage, infant learn the activities related to motor skills like walking, running, jumping, catching, throwing, etc. They start using their physical organs, internal organs and sensory organs in a better way. You can say it is very important stage for a child. I think student is quite enough for infancy stage. Well, make your notes from the videos and if you feel any problem, can ask on your group as well as you can comment in comment box. Thank you, but remember, keep studying.